All right, guys, Tony here from Signals Feed. Um, just sent out a signal not so long ago uh, for the GBP USD, uh, and it just broke past that resistance point. It was valid for about an hour, uh, and then um, a trend just picked up, and it's just found a new uh, resistance line around right about here, about 125, uh, 1.2597 mark. Um, it just just found a new one there. It's just peeked past that. I just managed to get a couple of trades in there. Uh, just off that that new resistance line there, so I'm just going to leave this to um, just 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 play out for a little bit longer. Um, I'm going to push this new signal out just yet. Um, I did tell people to just hang on for five minutes, let this calm down for a minute while that trend sort of just calmed down a little bit. It was here that um, it started trending, as you can see. It just just passed that resistance line, uh, which was about here. Um, in fact, that was a little bit further down. It's about here, 1.24 something. Um, and it, like I say, it's just broken straight past that, and we've got a new resistance line around about here, uh, which I've noticed, uh, which is what I'm playing with now. So I'm just going to place another. Let's just zoom in a little bit closer, see if uh, I can get it a little bit in a better position. Okay, the browser seems to be slowing down on me, so I think um, I'm just going to hold on for five minutes. Uh, I think my internet connection is slowing down, so it keeps sort of uh, slowing that chart down for me. So, um, yeah, I mean, one of the other things uh, I'm looking at at the moment, yesterday um, I was having a few problems with my IQ account. Uh, so today I'm having a look at Expert Option, uh, which was recommended to me. Uh, I'll put a link down below for this one. Uh, basically, it's very similar to the IQ platform, only a few differences. This one actually shows you when other traders are placing their trades. Uh, and what direction. So th this particular person, uh, Sheriff, placed a one dollar trade on a put uh, and it looks like he's going to win that. Um, this person here, uh, Joseph, um, he placed a call and um, it doesn't look like he's going to win. Uh, so I'd um, keep an eye out for that one. Uh, another put here, so like I say, a lot of people placing puts on this to expect it to shoot back down again. Um, so I'll just keep an eye on it. I don't think it's going to go much past the 1.25977 mark okay so it's just taking a nice downward trend there and it's got it's gone right back down towards where it was originally sat before uh so it's coming back up on itself there maybe maybe found a new support line um let's go back to the beginning there and uh yeah so right now it's just just flattening out a little bit from that dip wait for it to go back up towards the 1.25979 mark and uh, and then place another put. So just be patient with that and, uh, and that, that should come in. Um, it's, it's got me some good results today, this system. Uh, I was looking at Brent Oil earlier, which had a lot of people trading on it. Um, and um, it was very clear sort of support and resistance going on. Uh, and it was very easy to, to sort of apply that within the um, within this expert options trading platform so I'm just going to show you quickly right now because there's a lot of people trading this um, and it gives you a good idea about what, what people are doing uh, and it just gives you a good example of sort of how you can see as you can see here look all these sort of dots are people trading on this particular asset so um, we'll just zoom in slightly uh, as you can see if I zoom out a lot there's been some a lot of predictable sort of patterns going on, you know, it's, it's, it's a lot of these trends are sort of going up and coming down, you know, it seems to be hitting this support line here, bounce it back up again, you know, hit some resistance, come back down, and that's what everyone is doing here. So as you can see, th this person here, the last person to place that trade, he just caught it on his way back up, and um, this person may be a little bit late, you know, they probably all felt that it was going to come back down, and um, keep going, sorry. Uh, it's coming back down now, so hopefully these, these people come in, it will shoot back up uh, and end around about here in the money for them. So th this person is expecting it to go down again. So you can really get a good idea about how other people are trading. Uh, and it just sort of, it makes you feel a little bit better that, that at least you know that other people are sort of winning and losing. You can't win them all, you know, and it just goes to show that, that how people trade is, is completely different. So I'm going to place a call now on this because I do believe it's gone down quite far um, it's, it's more likely to come back up now. It's it's, uh, it's at a very low point over the past sort of 15, 20 minutes, and um, yeah, hopefully we'll, we'll be able to get another win on this. So um, again, just playing with these these patterns really. I've not sent this signal out because it's not available uh, on the IQs. 
Uh, and it's, it's very sort of unpredictable in terms of where the support and resistance is. It's just you can identify this pattern quite easily. And with the, uh, with the amount of people trading it, you know, for, for me, it looks like a good bet. So, um, yeah, at the moment, it's, uh, it's well in the money, this. Be very tempted to place a put now, uh, but that would obviously really narrow my sort of winning margins. Uh, it has to win, ma maintain it in the middle, or else I'd end up leaving, losing one of them. Uh, so right now I'm just going to take this one, and uh, and we should be able to get this in as a win. And since that's become so close to the expiry now. See, all these people expecting it to turn around again now. I'm just going to wait for it to turn before it does. There we go. I'm going to go for it now. So it came in nice and early there. Uh, just just waited for that 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 peak uh, and then come back on it. So placing a put on that. Okay, that first trade, that call, that won for me. Okay, so I'm just going to go in the opposite direction. Okay, it's creeping back up, but I do believe there's plenty of time for it to secure a win there. Uh, another 30 seconds on that trade, and we should be good. Uh, again, it's at a low position. It's just dropped again. There's a very good chance it's going to come back up now, um, and and obviously just just create another upward trend like that. It's just 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 flittering about between them support and resistance lines there. Uh, so again, it's coming back up. A little bit too late to get on this trade, um, but uh, once it comes past this peak, we've got what, two seconds. There we go. So just about got that one in as well. It's on its way down again. It's not come quite as far as I'd like. And there we go. So just uh, just coming up to that peak again, and uh, it's going to start turning any moment. So you can see everyone's anticipating that it's reached that peak a little bit more. Okay, it's very close to that original peak. Okay, it's just flattening out. There we go. It's on its way down again. See, again, it's just hit that resistance right there. Just bounce right back down. It's going to come straight back to this support line. there for me okay it's just springing back up now okay so uh, that, that support line hasn't gone down as far as I'd like uh, so it's just bouncing about now we're hoping it dips a little bit and um, we don't want it rising in the next sort of 30 45 seconds or so It's getting close, okay. So it's just taking a nice dip again. So, what we want to see, there we go. Okay, so that is another win. Let's get rid of that. Um, so yeah, I'm just going to post this signal up now. As you can see, we've found a nice support and resistance line there. Uh, so I'm just going to post that resistance up on the group. Uh, and I'll also post a link to this um, trading platform as well, because this asset may not be available on the um, IQ options. So I'm just going to get this up there in a moment. So yeah, just... Um, just keep an eye on this one. Let's see what else is going on. Okay, so that's five five point five one six zero. Right. 
Facebook's having my way. And you can see it's, it's not breaking past that support, uh, that resistance line there. Um, so we're, we're quite safe on this one at the moment, I think. So. I put a link in the description box uh, for this trading platform and it may not have this asset on your IQ options okay so while I look at that it's just come back up again just gonna wait for it to turn okay it's just broken past that resistance but I do believe it's gonna turn at any moment let's wait for that peak uh, and just wait for it to just slip back round okay I'm gonna come in now it might be a little bit early it's just just flickered um, I wouldn't like it to go down a bit further. There we go. It's on its way. So yeah, just it may just sort of peek past that resistance marker. You keep an eye on it, you know, and then as it starts coming back down, that's when you want it. It's just uh, just a slight fluctuation there. And um, so yeah, we need to put a link in there for that. Okay, so yeah, check that one out and um, you can get access to that now. Again, it's a free demo to let you use it. The benefit of this one is you can see what everyone else is doing, which I think is very good. Uh, it gives you, obviously in, a, in the IQ options, it does give you um, a list down the side. So that was another successful trade. Um, it does give you on IQ, it gives you that, that, that list down here, what percentage of people are, are sort of trading. Uh, this gives you a clear indication of how they're trading as well. So it really helps you learn how you should be using these peaks and, and sort of dips. So um, let's just zoom in and see what's going on here. We can see it's on its way back down again. You know, maybe a little bit late on getting that trade, but just getting that middle there. Um, I would prefer to get it at a, a higher position like the rest of them. But you can clearly see how people are trading on this. And I think that's going to be a benefit for everyone using this system, uh, especially with um, the, the, the style of signals that we're sending out with Stripe strike rates and I'm waiting for that particular asset to reach that and then striking uh, you can see that every now and again you may just peek past it um, but uh, hopefully if you can watch what they're doing uh, and, and jump on that peak as it's turning around in the opposite direction that's when you want to strike okay and um, so yeah put a link down below in the description box for this one and also if you want to get involved with these free signals group join the signals feed page uh, signalsfeed.com uh, just come and join us over there my mouse is going a bit mad there excuse me yeah I put a link down below for that uh, free signals all day uh, just just send us your ID number and we'll get you all set up uh, and in the group you can private message me uh, once you get access to the group and I'll get back to you as soon as possible um, so yeah take care guys bye bye